So can you tell me uh, what you're doing out here today? Um, selling lemonade for um, a charity cause. Um, it's a group called um, Our Children Making Change. And it's a group where 100 kids come together and they pledge to each make $100 over the summer. And they vote on their top four charities. And they get about 10 charities to vote from and then the most popular charities among the kids all the money that is ten thousand dollars that is made over the summer is going to be given to those um four charities uh two thousand five hundred dollars each and me and him are both going the meeting is today at 4 45 so we're gonna be there and we're gonna vote we're not sure which ones yet um a few kids are going to give presentations about each group and charity and then from that we're gonna see which ones we think that we like the most dedicated to the proposition and um what are some of the examples of the charity now we are cradles for crayons um or anything. Yeah, Family so Table, so Eye of the Storm, Why don't you read the Friends description, of honey? Boston First Homeless. Three. Okay. Uh, the children room is, uh, it supports grieving youth, and it's in um, Arlington, Massachusetts. The Eleven Spoonfuls um, rescues fresh food from restaurants, grocery stores, etc., and delivers it to people. It's in Boston, Massachusetts. And Gaining Ground, farm that distributes organic produce and um, meal programs and pantries. It's in Greater Boston, Massachusetts. And from what we can see now, we're not really thinking about what we're gonna do yet. We're gonna wait till the presentation, and I hope we find some good groups that we like and vote for them. It is rather for us to be dedicated great task the, the motivation from behind the project I think one of the spirits is uh, to that cause about how one child can make a change and can you talk a little bit uh, about that we here highly resolved that we well that I feel campaign. that it, one child making a change God is a that that there's that one child and over the summer if they pledge to make a hundred dollars a hundred dollars is a big difference it can really help launch um, of better ways to uh, uh, help the community and charity and get um, help people get better lives, better food, better education, better homes. Um, like, I, I think the same as him, but like, yeah, like, I think it's a big thing about how, like, kids can, like, I just read a book in school actually about how kids, they, they can change the world. It's not just grown-ups who can change the world, it's because it starts, like, it's like this, it's like the seed of it, and then it will grow and maybe like kids will be changed in the world like every month or so, so yeah and when you think about it the kids are all actually helping other kids who are homeless or don't have good education or don't have enough food and are unhealthy um, so it's just like having and friends are just helping other kids and it's not just kids, grown-ups too. You can really help the grown-ups and the grown-ups can become your friends as well. Well, thank you so much for talking about it. I really appreciate it. Thank you. Thanks, could you just tell me a little bit about Children's for Change and how people could get involved if they're not able to come down to the pond today? Okay, I'll do my best. My name's Ann Malone. I'm a mom uh, that lives in Jamaica Plain. I have two children in the Boston Public Schools and another mom at my son's elementary school, the Curly K-8, right here in Jamaica Plain. Um, put out information about a group called Our Children Making Change. Actually, a relative of her started it, a relative of hers in Baltimore, and it's now um, hopefully spreading across the country. I think we're the sixth city, and we're trying to get children from all over the city, all the neighborhoods, to come together, and I think there's 100 this launch year, and they're gonna meet today and um, hear from kids in the group about these community organizations that they feel need support and talk about why. And then at the end of the presentations, the 100 or so children will vote on their top four choices. And those will be the organizations that at the end of the summer, 
a hundred kids raising a hundred dollars each reach the goal of ten thousand dollars maybe more it will be divided among those four organizations and we're hoping that the kids will get a sense of power um, from how one child joining together with others can you know really make a difference in the world and they can learn about new you know new parts of the city new organizations you know maybe shape what they do into the future and then their adults helping other kids get involved in things like this so i'm really grateful to kristen shapiro who's the mom in jamaica plain and the website um that's on the uh, our children making change well, thank you so much information for the this is in spanish and then here's the english is um www.ourchildrenmakingchange.org so please get involved thanks <laughs>